Hey everyone, this is J Dog, and I am here with another video. Do you see this man? This is Pete Booty Bootages, or who I like to call Pete Booty Jizz, you know, because. Alright, so the lamestream media is at it again. As you know, Pete Booty Jizz over here is not doing well when it comes to black votes. He is not getting black voters. Black voters are basically distancing himself away from him. Most of the black voters who are voting in the 2020 election are either going for Gabbard, Biden, Sanders, Warren, Kamala, whoever's left in the black community that still wants to support Booker or Kamala, but not Pete Booty Jizz over here. And now the lamestream media is upset about that to the point where they have believed that the reason why he's not getting black votes is because of, hear this, homophobia. That's right, as you know, Pete Booty Jizz is a a gay man. He is part of the LGBT community. And once again, like I said before, this is not an attack on the LGBT. In fact, there has been members of the LGBT community that are not going to vote for Pete Buttigieg. That's right. See, they're not talking about that. They're not talking about the fact that his own community, or at least his own community by sexual orientation, the LGBT community, has said no to booty jizz because he does not believe in things like Medicare for all or net neutrality or things that some of the LGBT members who are voters and other reasons that he is a corporate corrupt democrat he has done some a lot of shady policies and some of the lgbt are not happy about that the reason why black voters let's go back to black voters the black community being i'm part of the black community is not going for booty jizz is not because of his sexual orientation we know that we have members in the black community that are also lgbt whether it be a gay man a lesbian female, a bisexual man or woman, a transgender, etc. And we don't attack them because of their sexual orientation. Yes, there's not a lot of us that are LGBT in the community compared to the white community or other communities who have a higher number of LGBT representatives. But here's the thing. His orient sexual orientation is not the reason why black voters are not going for him. The reason why most black voters are not going for Buttigieg is because years ago he fired a black police chief who was their only black police chief and people find it very suspicious when he did that, especially when the police chief was trying to expose corruption within his own department when he discovered racist e um, racist tapes of cops saying racial slurs that were negative towards the black community and booty jizz claimed that he didn't have the power to reveal them in reality he didn't want to make the police department responsible for releasing them and when the police chief wanted to release them they fired him right before they had the chance then, of course, the handling of certain shootings that led to one shooting that led to a death of an African-American by a police officer. He had mishandled that. And then recently in Chicago, when he was campaigning in Chicago, he had the backing of an attorney, one of the attorneys who was involved with the cover-up attempt of Jason Van Dyke's killing of Laquan McDonald to the point where pressured he had no choice but to cut ties with that individual because that individual was part of the cover-up. See at first Buttigieg wanted to work with the guy until the black community found out that he was part of the corruption 
of Jason Van Dyke killing Will Kwan McDonald trying to cover him up to get him off, and a lot of people were outraged, which led to Booty Jizz cutting ties with him. Even though he did cut ties, we have not forgiven Booty Jizz for the fact that he was working with the individual, and rightfully so. He does not deserve our forgiveness. He knew that man was part of a cover-up that killed a 16-year-old African-American individual. So yeah, these are the real reasons why Booty Jizz over here, looking all upset, looking confused, is not getting votes. But the lamestream media is trying to make excuses saying that it's homophobia. Why? Because they want to push the, that narrative that black people are the most homophobic. When in actuality, it's the community that began uh, the, the, you know, the sexual orientation, which was European culture, meaning white people. European culture was among the first to display homosexuality in their culture. However, it's also the same community, but because of the fact that their birth rates are low, they're trying to get rid of that side of that, of their culture by posing laws against. They're the ones who have been more homophobic. Because they blame the LGBT for one of the reasons why their communities, white people's communities, birth rates are going down. At the same time, they want to push it towards our community to depopulate our numbers. But yet, to do that, they want to shame us for being straight. They want to make more people in our community LG alphabet. And shame any black person who is proud to be a heterosexual. That's the real another reason why they're pushing this narrative that homophobia is the reason why booty jizz is not getting black voters. Both the lamestream media and Pete booty jizz are shameful. And let's not forget the most obvious: Pete booty jizz does not support in giving us cash payments for reparation. So that's another reason why Booty just he has never ex even talked about um giving us reparations. Yeah, he talked about it when that one when um Jamie and B Fowler confronted him on the phone, he only and the reason why Booty just did talk about reparations then was because he was caught on camera. Because he knows that he's struggling to get the black vote. So yeah. In reality, Booty Jizz does not really believe in reparations for black people. He believes in reparations for gays, for the LGBT. And I'm not saying that, uh, that whether they d don't or do deserve reparations, but, um, Booty Jizz does not believe in reparations for black people. That's what I'm talking about. So, why should we, why should the black community, why should foundational black Americans vote for Booty Jizz if he's not going to do anything for our interest? So, yeah. So yeah, that's the real reasons why he's struggling. Not homophobia, like the lamestream media is saying so whenever the cnn i just saw a bunch of news cnn msnbc they're all pushing this narrative that it's homophobia that's the reason why booty jizz is not getting black voters which is very shameful and is part of their uh, freaking agenda to depopulate us or to use us and we have to push back I don't think Booty Jizz is going to win. He's, his poll numbers are shrinking. Not as much as Kamala or some of the... We also found out that Betty O'Rourke has called it quits. See, but uh, yeah, Booty Jizz, but it's still... His poll numbers are not good. 
And one of the reasons why is he's not getting black voters. Booty Jizz, even if he's like in fourth or fifth place, where he is is not a good spot. If he can't get us as a voting block, he is not going, not only going to win, he's not going to beat Trump. He's not even going to be nominated to even get the presidential nomination for the Democrats. He is, Booty Jizz is to the point where he's going to have to eventually wait for the next few months, wait to at least early next year. And do not be surprised if he, within at least the latest, somewhere between January and February of next year, if he's out of the race. Because it looks like it's getting to that point where his campaign is about to shut down. But that's all I have to say. I want to know what y'all think in the comment section about this. Uh, make sure you like, share the video, subscribe if you haven't subscribed, and hit that notification. Um, that's all I have to say for now. This is J-Dog. Thank you for watching, and I hope to catch y'all in another video. Peace, everyone.